Hey everyone, here's the wrap up for season 294. Just want to say thanks to everyone. Uh, I'd originally planned to do a completely different kind of theme for this week. And then I changed my mind kind of right at the last minute because this is one that I've been thinking about <clears throat> for a couple of years. I figured I'd go ahead and give it a shot. Uh, even though uh, I was kind of worried that it might be a disaster, but it worked out pretty well. Uh, just a little rundown of the numbers. It looks like, you know, I might have miscounted. I might have missed somebody. If I missed anybody and didn't get you on the playlist, let me know. I'll add you to the playlist. Uh, it looks like we had a total of 98 songs, not including the ones I did. And uh, 46 people, 46 different seasonistas, not counting me participated. A couple of them showed up who I haven't seen in a while, like You Can One and Bonsai, Janet and Wendy. I was kind of happy to see them show up for my season. Uh, and the uh, <clears throat> the different topics that were covered, I wasn't surprised to see ghosts cover the most. That's probably the easiest one. There's probably more ghost songs than there are Bigfoot songs. <laughs> but uh looks like this is how I counted them. They, this might not be exact, but it looks like we had 14 songs about aliens or UFOs, four different songs about angels, eight different songs about uh, cryptozoological things, five songs about ESP or psychic powers, uh, four songs about the fairy folk and and related, uh, 24 songs about ghosts. Seven songs about uh, magic, more or less, and most of which seem to be about uh, voodoo or sort of black type magic. And then uh, I called nine songs just monster songs. They're, you know, they're more monster than cryptozoological. Eh, whatever. And then 23 more songs that I just put in a miscellaneous category. They didn't really fit in any of the other big categories, just about this and that. Uh, enjoyed them all. Eleven original songs, I think. Three each from Bird's Eye View and Fabrizer. Uh, two from from uh, Bernie, Barbara Blanca. And then one each from One Man and His You, Carrie 122, and Dean Beaver. I uh, really want to make a special mention to uh, Bernie's song, Topical Witchcraft. That, that was a super song. I really love that song. And I also really enjoyed Pop Rizzer's Only Idiot See Yowies. That was pretty funny, and, <laughs> and I, I really liked it. Uh, I just want to thank everyone for for uh, participating. I heard some songs that I kind of expected and, and several songs that I'd heard before. But there were lots of songs that were totally new to me, which is great. I always love hearing new songs. Oh, yeah, I also wanted to mention one of the new songs I'd never heard before was The Grizzly Bride by Joe the Toad. About the werewolf bride. That, that was a cool song. I like that one. And, uh, of course, Manfrog coming in the, at the last minute as usual with his cryptozoological love song. And I uh, also want to point out um, Recovering Bassist with his song The Devil Was Laughing at Me, which was uh, the original recording of that was a collaboration between Jimmy C. Newman and Tom T. Hall. Most people who uh, watch my videos probably haven't realized this yet, but those are two of my favorite country music guys, so I really like that. TCK with his Bigfoot song by Buddy Knox. I think that's it. That, that song, if you go looking for Bigfoot songs, you're going to run across that song everywhere, so I'm glad he did that. Because I, I actually never listened to it. I just kept seeing it pop up everywhere, but I never listened to it. <laughs> Till now, that was a cool song. And uh, The Only Uke That Matters with books about UFOs written by the great Grant Hart who recently passed away. That was that was great. Um, man, Euphoria, Synchronicity too. That was, I could have never imagined anybody could pull that off on a ukulele, but that was pretty good. Ugh. Too many more to mention. 
One song that I was hoping somebody would tackle but nobody did was Spontaneous Human Combustion. There is one song about that. Just in case somebody wants to file that away for <laughs> something in the future in case you get to use it. In case anybody does, song, does songs about fire or something like that. Anyway, uh, thanks everybody. No prizes. Just, just my great thanks to everyone who participated and especially everyone who wrote original songs. And I'll see you at the forum. Thank you.